Yo, what is up guys? So for today, we're going to be looking at the season pass and the season pass only. So if you're looking for the Eververse video, I have already done it. That video should be up by now. I'll have it in the description and the comments if you guys want to look at that video. But uh, before we start with the video. So before we start with the video, I just want to let you guys know that a high percentage of people that watch my videos are not subscribed according to my analytics. So if you could do me a favor and subscribe, hit that bell notification. I would very much appreciate it if you like my content, if you like just me in general that would really help me out so on with the video all right so season of the chosen here is the season pass for the first one obviously we always get the seasonal exotic plus the seasonal exclusive armor and an xp boost apparently let's get it there it is can i get it again no it's probably just lagged out so obviously we end up getting upgrade stuff as usual this is not a surprise to pretty much anyone but we do get small chance to earn additional Cabal Gold from Strikes, Gambit, Crucible, and Public Events, which I don't know what that means, but I'll find out later. It's probably something to do with the season, obviously. Uh, Ritual Glimmer Boost, uh, Small Fire Team XP, XP, same stuff. And then if you guys didn't see it in the last video, that is actually our seasonal finisher, which I gotta say I actually do like. I like it a lot, so my Titan's definitely gonna wear that. But we get this shader as well, which I think looks good. Uh, I'm I'm pretty okay with it. And then the next page is going to be Catalyst Quest Boost Alpha, which is the boost for the new seasonal weapon, which I wonder what the fuck it is. And then Umbral Engrams, which I should be making a video of that separately. And then Eververse Engram, which unfortunately we still can't look at all of the stuff that's in the Engram, but... From what Bungie has told us, it's literally everything from two seasons before. No, it's from the season before. So basically everything from Season of the Hunt and Beyond Light is going into this engram on top of everything that's been before. So that's a really big loot pool. Hopefully Bungie makes something where we can have targeted loot for this specific thing. I also have not seen any armor drop from this, so if you have seen armor drop from it from any of your friends or you yourself, let me know in the comments below. And again, uh, XP boost, legendary shard dismantle bonus, which is nice. It's always nice to have that. And then another catalyst quest boost Omega. I also, also, if you're a free to play player, I'm not going through these mostly because they're not stuff like this. Uh, obviously you you guys can tell what you guys are getting from here so if you're a free-to-play player don't don't take it like I'm ignoring you it's just that most of the stuff that we, we have to see and read is mostly at the bottom so again no no shame no shade trying to be thrown just saying small fire team XP boost obviously arms bonus which is this class plus mass the plus one master work level to all season pass legendary armor rewards which is okay and then we get Threaded Needle, which is a linear fusion rifle. It's a shame we got a fucking linear fusion rifle, considering linears are bad. But we'll see, whatever. And then we get Bright Dust, which is fine. And then all of this stuff. And then Tiku's Divination, which is this season's seasonal weapon, which looks cool. Uh, I just wonder how it's going to be played i still haven't used it obviously you guys saw me open the box in the beginning so i have dude i'm like really trying to spit as many videos as i can right now and so that way i can just play the season but let's see what this is cabal gold boost 2 which again probably helps do something with the season and then testudo which is i don't know how i feel about it um maybe we'll change armor later just to see how it looks but I'm, oh, I'm fine with it, I guess. And then we get the sidearm here, which... What is it? Aggressive. Ooh, a two burst! All right, so you're you're replacing the, the, the sidearm that I lost from Season of Dawn with this one, which is completely fine. As long as you give me some fire-ass uh, stuff, then I'm okay with it. Actually, did I miss one? No, I did. Oh, wait. No, no, I did. So then... Vanguard Armor Scrounger grants a chance to receive additional Season Pass armor drops from completing strikes, which is cool, I guess. Increase XP by 2%. Um, class Master Pla yeah. Then we get the Ghost, which I showcased last episode. Threaded Needle Masterwork Bonus. 
Increase the tier level of all season pass threaded needle weapons by plus. Okay, it's weird. Uh, grants a chance to re receive additional armor drops from completing gambit strike or um, gambit matches, which is fine. Increase fire team XP. Plus one master rick level to all chess pieces. And then we actually start to get to the actual seasonal ornaments, which, oh, I hate that. I hate that right there. That looks weird. Uh, I apologize if I'm not, I'm probably not going to show you the Titans or the Warlocks, mostly because I don't want to. Like, I don't want to like, uh, we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. We'll see how long this video ends up. It's probably going to be on the short side, so we'll, we'll have time to do it. Uh, legend plus one mass uh, masterwork level to legendary helmet rewards, which is again weird weird Okay Grants a chance to receive additional season pass threaded needle drops from completing strikes and Then this should be the last gold boost. Maybe Grants a chance to receive additional season pass threaded needle drops. Oh my god, Jesus and then an exotic uh, two plus and then the cloak, which is not a cloak, which is cool. I actually think this is fire. Um, I know a lot of people have issues with the armor set. I actually think it's okay. It's not that big a deal. A lot of people are like, oh, this is another shitty armor set. And it's like, I, I like it. There's pieces of it that I can really use and utilize. And this, I think this one's gonna be a big one for me. And then uh, stuff, another XP boost. Let's see this one. It's fine. Oh shit, let's see this one. That looks really cool. Oh my god. That's not even the the last piece for the whatchamacallit. Actually, did we see this? Yeah, we did. And then uh grant a chance to receive additional season pass brass attacks drops from complete. So this must be the sidearm? Is that what it's called? Brass attacks? That's weird. <laughs> okay, whatever. Uh, brass attacks again. And then the helmet, which I'm not a big fan of. Everyone's memeing about it that it looks like a face completely. I see it and I hate it. That's why I hate it now. And then let's see the blade breaker. Okay. And then the skin for, which just turns pieces of it gold, I guess. Maybe the arrows turn different, but whatever. That's pretty much it. Uh, let's go see something real quick. Let me see, because past seasons you could do this. Okay, so this is how the hunter will look. Just basic bitch. I hate the little horn in the on the top. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. Hate it. But overall, this armor does look pretty fire. Not gonna lie. Let's go see the masterwork. Hmm. It doesn't look horrid. At least I can say. Definitely the pants are kind of like the biggest thing that are just like, what the fuck is going on? But other than that, I, I fuck with it. It's fire. It looks cool. I definitely will switch out the the cloak, this this right here, with the other one. Just because I feel like the hunter having it all full cloak would be better. So let's go to the Titans and the Warlocks because we have enough time. Yeah, it's got 10 minutes. We got like got enough time uh i say that i'm so you guys probably don't know i want to make as many videos as i can before my girlfriend gets home because once my girlfriend gets home i'm literally just going to be playing destiny 2 all day to get some rolls on just weapons uh, i'm gonna mute this so let's just let's just go to the season pass so this is the titans and I like the mark. The mark is surprisingly cool. I definitely think this is bad, and then it doesn't even get better at the end. So, unfortunately, you get Conehead, which, <clears throat> for some people, they're like, oh, I hate this. I personally don't mind. I like the Mongolian feel. It's I don't know why people are saying, like, Greek or Roman or whatever. It's like, I don't see that at all. I do see Mongolian, though, and... This shit does look fire. Like, I like it a lot. Um, I think the asymmetrical look is not good on Titans. It would have been... Well, it's good in certain pieces. I don't think this is a piece. 
because this armor piece right here does not seem like it's actually on correctly so it just feels like it's just gonna fall off at the like the mere touch also this thing i said this before i hate this i don't know what the fuck this is but it's the same way i feel about the chest piece for the europa armor it's like why the fuck are you putting that on that so like unfortunate but whatever let's go to the warlocks so yeah, I'm trying to complete this as fast as I can so that way I can have enough videos for today, tomorrow, and whatever. Because I'm probably going to post the Eververse video and this video up t today and then like other stuff later. So there's just so much to do, man. Uh, this is why I like a season, the beginning of a season, because there's just so much to do. So this is, oof. I... I don't know how I feel about it. I really don't. Warlocks, let me know what you feel. I don't personally know. Let's look at the other one. Damn, it did not get better. Okay, so I don't like it. Yeah, I, I can tell you right now, I don't like it. Uh, Warlocks, you got the L on this one again. And it's not even surprising, y'all take L's a lot for armor. Uh, the balls are not helping, and it's just that like your chest piece covers fucking everything. Oh man, dude. I, I'm so sorry, Warlocks. So that's pretty much it. Let me know what you guys think about the season pass, about the armor, about the new exotic in the comments below. If you guys want to follow me on my social media, I'll just leave it in the description below. Thank you everyone for the support. I really do appreciate it. It's it's very heartwarming to see people like my stuff, even though I feel like my content's dog shit. So I will see you guys later.